hello everyone welcome to nails world and in this video i'll show you what you can achieve using a mobile phone camera in your obs projects or in your web meetings if you do not have a webcam you can use your mobile phone effectively as a very good webcam i'm using a sony zv1 right now and i'll show you what you can achieve using a mobile phone this is what you can see in a proper lighting condition that the results do not vary much i am using the sony zv1 as a webcam using the cam link 4k and i'm using a samsung a30 let us get it side by side i'm using a samsung a30 on a wi-fi network to get this result i do not have extra port to use a usb cable otherwise the latency issues would have been solved there is certain latency issue in the wi-fi connection so you can see a bit of lag in the mobile phone footage so if you can figure it out footage and my system is very low end system that's why there may be some frame drops when you see this video because i'm using two cameras simultaneously to record this whole thing so if you see my display so you can see my whole setup i'm using obs i'm using the sony zv1 as my video source and a samsung a30 as my video source to connect a samsung samsung a30 with obs what i am using i'm using a software plugin called droid cam obs it is there are different apps from the same uh, developer uh, droid cam droid cam x and droid cam obs droid cam is a free version which allows you a lower resolution output from your mobile phone when you use that app as a webcam app droid cam x is the paid software which allows you to have higher resolutions up to 4k or maybe 1080p droid cam obs specifically is made only to work with obs so if you use obs you don't have to run a different webcam app in your system to access your mobile phone as a webcam and hopefully if you try this method if you try droid cam obs you will be very amazed to see how good is the result so this is what exactly it looks when you have the obs uh, droid cam obs app or plugin with uh, sony uh, with the samsung a30 samsung a30 is a very low end mobile phone which does not have a very good quality camera but still this footage seems to be quite usable you can use it in uh, in your zoom meetings or google meet meetings and if you use the virtual what you call the virtual camera mode of obs you can bring in obs uh, the whole footage of obs or the whole production of obs into your virtual meetings you can switch cameras in your meetings you can share screen without sharing screen in your meetings by using obs if you know how to use obs you can do a lot of things if you do not have a webcam you can always use your mobile phone by use of softwares like droid cam obs if you do not want to use droid cam obs you can also use softwares like ivy cam or irian webcam to get a very good quality footage out of your mobile phone when you use that as a webcam for your zoom meetings for your google meet meetings or for a general obs project when you have an obs project you can do a lot of things because obs is a very powerful software obs plus your mobile phone can give you a very good result so this is neil and you are watching neil's world and hopefully if you like this video please do consider subscribing to my channel and do give this video a thumbs up so that it gives a positive signal to the algorithm do keep watching my videos for more application based or tutorial based videos for using technology for your day-to-day -day life in an effective way